히트 다 히트 <웃음> 히트 시즌 2. 니다 김대엽 선수 만나보겠습니다. 축하드립니다. 네 감사합니다. Congrats. 자 스타리그 장학생 다운 모습이었습니다. 저에서 가장 먼저 8강에 진출한 소감 들어볼게요. 어 사실. How do you feel about getting into the round of eight as the first member of the group? 엄청 올라가고 싶었는데 뭔가 좀 많이 불안불안했어요. 떨어질까봐. He wanted to make it out really bad, but for some reason he felt a lot of pressure. He was very nervous about it. He just felt uneasy. Although he was really nervous, uh, he feels good because he felt like he still gave a pretty good performance at the end of the day. <laughs> This is the only league that he has to focus on. He dropped out of, or yeah, he didn't get into the DSL, so he can practice a bit more hard for this one, and you know it really worked out today. So he's asking about being eliminated in the GSL. What was the reason behind it? <laughs> Very straightforward question from Kanata. Why stats? <laughs> stats saying he felt pretty burned out actually. Ran out of stamina with how long he's been in the GSL. <laughs> Although Stats was expected to make it to at least the round of four, you, focused, or you struggled a little bit today against Bomber. He's asking, like, what was with all the over-aggression? Kanata's asking the straightforward question. It's very close with stats, obviously. Saying he's not in the best condition, even though he did get a good night's sleep last night. Still not feeling all together. I was pretty worried about it, and even the coach was asking, like, hey, what, what's going on? He actually asked him that question after the match with Bomber. Yeah, that was definitely not his finest play. Yeah. Stad saying he's very motivated and still very driven to do really well here. Definitely wants to put on a great show winning the tournament this time. We were talking about the game where he got about 60 workers of bombers. One of the viewers asked, actually, do you know how many SCVs you actually killed? <laughs> Stats saying, uh, as he was clutching that game, he felt pretty mean. He felt like he was being very malicious to all those workers and to Bomber. <laughs> this really must hurt Bomber's mentality, <laughs> killing 60 workers I mean, in that game. He has the dead probe as his, uh, his icon. He is the worker killer yes, here in Star League. <laughs> So, because the whole concept of Group B is the proving grounds, does Stats feel like he proved himself so far? Saying there's still a little bit more in the tank, he's got more to show. He'll continue working hard at massacring the enemy workers. The second set against Deer, the build was very akin to Hero's build that he used against Deer. This is what I was talking about during the game. Stats saying, yeah, that's what Hero used in Pro League against Deer. 
stats says players. that he's actually the player that helped Hero practice yeah. that build. <laughs> so <laughs> it's a pretty good build. <laughs> Seems like these two came up with it together. <laughs> At least yeah. perhaps the <laughs> idea or the exact build. <laughs> Stats being asked, when is the last time you built a, built a Zealot? That's the question that every He's Blizzard like, employee <laughs> wants to hear. <laughs> He's saying, I try to incorporate Zealots into my build, but that's kind of written out by this point. He's like, I, I, he's like, does canceling them count in PVT? <laughs> I like, started one one time, like a couple months ago. Asking about stats is preference when it comes to maps. There are certain maps that are very good against Terran when he's playing against Bomber. Dust Towers. Although he didn't want to play that map. He wasn't confident that explains why he didn't all in uh, on the map. It also explains why he picked it third. Oh, oh he's talking about King Sejong, okay. So, he felt like if he just went along with what the other player picked for maps 2 and 3, he could avoid King Sejong, which is probably the reason why we didn't see it, even though Bomber picked it first. So he says, builds aren't everything, map selection is also very important. I actually wish we got to get cast of the map draft, because like, there's yeah. so much that goes into that right now. That happens right before the game as well, it's not actually happening like a week in advance. I would love to cast that, like casting a MOBA draft or something, because there's so much mindset yeah. and mentality something goes into those picks. Finally, what would you like to say to the fans? Saying, personally, he's very disappointed that he came in second place in the last Star League. So he promises that he's going to practice really hard, make sure he wins the tournament this time, shows that for all the fans. Yeah, and I said it, you know, when we were casting earlier, this is, you know, last the last chance for stats. He knows it, he's not in the GSL. It's very important yeah. that he got out today. Crazy group that he actually got knocked out of. I think, what was it, Myungshik got out first or something Gumeo, crazy? I think as well. Maybe Gumio got out first, maybe it was that one. But uh, guys, we are going to jump into Bomber versus Gumio after a quick commercial break. Actually, we're gonna go back to us first. So, all right, no, we're going. No, we're, we're out. out. Oh. We're out. Peace. <laughs> See you guys. See after you guys this in a break. bit. <laughs>